the Ndebele people of Zimbabwe, has been arrested upon re-entry to Zimbabwe. He was on his way to his coronation in Bulawayo tomorrow. Our correspondent, Efet Mosekiwa, joins us now live from Harare. Efet, very, thank you very much indeed for joining us. What do we know at this stage? Uh, good evening, Herman. Uh, what we know at the present moment is that uh, there had been a planned coronation of um, the Mele King tomorrow, Saturday, and um, the plan was it was planned to start at 7 a.m. But uh, during the course of the week, uh, specifically yesterday, the High Court uh, ruled that uh, the, um, uh, it is um, uh, it is illegal uh, and, and unconstitutional for uh, for them for the coronation to go ahead. The Minister of Local Government, uh, Comrade July, actually issued a, pre uh, a statement yesterday saying that it is illegal. So today uh, there were uh, uh, people that went into Blauer Town and besieged the High Court and uh, riot police had to be called. We are also getting reports that some tear gas uh, canisters were actually fired at the protesters. Uh, we also have been trying to get all of them of the organizers of the coronation who, who claim that they still want to go ahead with the coronation tomorrow. And as we speak right now, the prince is still being held at Joshua Mkabukongkomo Airport. That's the main airport in Blawayo. Uh, he's been detained, and uh, we haven't gotten further details as to really what, what, what is going to happen to him tonight. Yeah. Yeah. If it, uh, keep on that story. I know the situation is fluid at this moment, but stand by. We'll be trying to cross with you uh, a little later on. So that is uh, the uh, arrest of Bulelani Lubengula Kumalo, the crown prince, who's been uh, rearrested, uh, well, arrested in uh, Zimbabwe. So we'll keep on that story in a short while. Francis? Thank you very much, Blaine. Armed